What has led to these type of performances from you guys in the last month? Um, you know, it's, it's, there's probably some common themes. Um, you know, defensively, we have not been able to get stops in those games. Um, we've dug ourselves a big hole early in those games. Um, you know, we just, we haven't matched um, what it takes to be competitive in an NBA game um, on multiple occasions now. Um, and it's concerning. Um, five turnovers. I think they scored after all five turnovers in that first quarter. Um, how do you guys value the ball more? Yeah. Uh, you know, it's something that philosophically, um, turnovers is, you know, I think turnovers of aggression, turnovers when you're trying to create, you know, opportunities for teammates, um, can happen or, um, never encouraged, but you know, they're kind of, uh, something that happens that it can actually be a sign of some positive things. Um, when we're just throwing it away and giving it away, um, you know, maybe being indecisive, not being strong, um, not being aggressive, um, and, and live ball and they're scoring, uh, we need less of them. And, you know, we've, we have, uh, addressed and talked about it some, um, we got to just get better with it. Mason Plum Plumley on the offensive glass. We've seen you guys struggle a little bit on the offensive glass. What did he do that made it so tough on you guys again tonight? No, he he had a he had a determination um, to get to the glass, to to get the tip ins, to get boards. Um, you know his quickness, his his mobility uh, was a problem for us. Terry Rozier had 17 points in the first quarter. Just why why do you think he was able to get so loose tonight? Uh, there's a lot of things, uh, transition, um, transition threes, transition threes off of turnovers. Um, you know, they, they, uh, they run a lot of off ball screens for them. Um, you know, they executed well, um, screened well, um, you know, ball is a great facilitator, um, creates opportunities for his teammates. I'm sure Rozier was a benefit of that. So my guess is 17 in the first quarter was probably a little bit of everything. When you're down that big early as a coach, how do you how do you keep the players engaged in, in the game? Um, well, I mean, our group, you know, they they uh, they have a lot of pride, and uh, you know, sometimes you can dig yourselves out of a big hole just possession by possession and um, short chunks of time, and um, you know, we weren't able to do that tonight. Coach Giannis only took seven shots. I'm just wondering how you saw Charlotte try to limit him and and what they did against him. Uh, same thing we see probably every night. A lot of bodies, a lot of people in the paint. Um, and I don't think it was anything uh, that they came up to that was um, particularly different or new. After that first quarter, the game, if you look at just the, the scores quarter to quarter, the, the game was more competitive. What did you see just after the first quarter? It doesn't matter. Um, with Giannis, that's the first time he scored in single digits in almost two years. First time he hasn't recorded an assist in almost two years as well. Um, how did he not, like, I guess, what did you see from him in particular? Not maybe their defense, just that led to him not being able to either find a crack or create for others. Yeah, I mean, you know, at the end of the day, um, there's at least a couple of, just easy, um, high percentage um, low layups that he, you know, I'm taking that, you know, nine out of ten. He's he's going to shoot an extremely high percentage. Um, so he uncharacteristically missed a couple of uh, good ones. Um, you know, I'm sure we missed a lot of uh, opportunities or didn't convert on passes that he made. Um, and that's what happens when you get beat badly. Coach, just a little bit more big picture, like. You guys have, like Eric mentioned, four 20-point losses, like five and seven, I think, in the last stretch. Like, it's just sort of a new situation for your, your group. Um, I guess how, how are you trying to manage that, navigate that situation? Yeah, just go back to our basics. Um, both, you know, big picture, every day, stuff we've been doing for a long time together that's been very good for us. All right, thanks.